We have the Sam Inflatable. And oh, somebody sneezed. God bless you. Was that you that sneezed? If so, I think I need the Lysol. I'm glad I'm wearing this mask because that guy definitely has the COVID. I told you to stay away. Oh my God. <laughs> All right, guys, today we are in Greenwood, South Carolina, and peeking out from behind the tree in the distance is an awesome looking spirit Halloween. Also, my generator just quit working and I'm not very happy about that, but I am happy about the spirit Halloween. Look at this, this is kind of cool. I like the shape of this, how it's smaller at the bottom and it gets bigger as it goes up. All right, let's go in and see what kind of awesomeness they have inside the Spirit Halloween. And holy crap, they have a bunch of animatronics set up, guys. Mark this day in history. Greenwood, South Carolina, I am so proud of you right now. Yes, this is what we want to see when we come into a Spirit Halloween and see the Spirit Halloween factory. Look at all the animatronics they actually have set up. Guys, I love hearing all of the animatronics at once going absolutely below. All right, let's start with Beetlejuice because I hear him saying things I haven't heard before. Yeah, every time I record Beetlejuice, he says the same thing. Hold on, we're getting another one. All right, Beetlejuice, do it again. I'll get to you, and I'll get to you. We can't even hear him. It's so chaotic in here right now. I love it. All right, Mr. Spidey, let's get you going. I've missed you. Come on, I've missed you, sir. Come on. What in the world is this guy waiting for? Come on, mister. Wouldn't that figure. He was jumping at me a minute ago, now he's not doing anything. You're disappointing me, Mr. Spider. Come on, do it, do it, do it. Look at this, he won't even jump at me. What in the heck, he must truly be haunted. All right, sir. Every time I try to hear him, Mr. Scream jumps at us. All right, I'm paying attention to you. I see that you have your knife to gut us like a fish. All right, let's go on over to this side here where we have Buzzsaw. Look at this. First of all, if you bought the Buzzsaw, you would definitely have to fatten him up because he's got the big clothes to be fat, but he just looks like thin, especially from the side. Let's look at him over here. Come on, Mr. Buzzsaw, I'm trying to see the side. Look at that. <laughs> he's skinny from the side. But look at this, he's working. How cool is that? And I have a really evening all over this place. <laughs> he's working really good, actually. He even keeps moving once he shuts up. See, look. Okay, now let's see. There he goes again. I saw that. I saw that. I love how all of these are on the sensors, so they just start moving whenever you walk by. Okay, waving Wally. I haven't seen you for quite some time. Yikers, that almost got me. You look like a freak show. If you need a job, I'll introduce you to the boss. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> look at this. He's just constantly trying to saw my face off. I'm trying to listen to Wally here, if you don't mind, sir. All right, one more time, Wally. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, at least we get some laughing from Wally while this guy's trying to buzz saw my face off over here. All right, here's one we haven't seen in a piece. It's Mr. Howl. Look at his teeth. He needs the aqua fresh. He is a giant fellow. Look at the size of those feet, man. Imagine getting kicked in the head with one of those. You'd be out for a week. Oh, look at the head. He could squish your head with those hands. All right, mister. I want to hear you howl one more time. Let's do it. Look at those eyes. Oh, you spooky fellow. Ha <laughs> ha. You got to love Mr. Howl. All right. We got Wacky over here, too. All right, Mr. Wacky. I'm stepping right up. <laughs> I'll be first on my block to say Wacky Mole needs some Aqua Fresh. I love that so much, guys. All of them are just going at the same time. I know, I hear you, Mr. Howell. All right, look over here, guys. We have a waving Wally here. And then we have a Harvester of Souls for sale. He's a big one. We have a Fogging Skull Pile over here. And a Wacky Mole. Oh, and look what we have over here, guys. 
Holy crap, it's a whole plethora of evil babies! We have this guy that we've seen in almost every spirit. I can never remember his name. What the heck is this guy's name? Oh, Gorius George. <laughs> That's what it is. He is gory. Then we have Little Miss throwing a fit. We have two of them, and look at her eyes. Look at this, I never noticed before, but her eyes are like reflective. How evil is that? Take your evil eyes and go back in. You're gonna get a spanking. I told you to clean up your room. No more spirit Halloween. Ah, so all I have to do is clean my room and I get to go to spirit. This will be easy. Maybe they'll buy me a harvester of souls. <laughs> Wait, so all I have to do is stop munching this hand and it'll take me to spirit after I clean my room. I cleaned up all my snakes. Can I go to spirit Halloween? Woohoo, we get to go to spirit. Oh my gosh, you gotta love the babies, guys. Look at this. It's like a big toy store in here. That's why we love this place so much. And holy crap, speaking of toys, look what they have here. I cannot remember, guys, if I bought the vintage Wolfman doll. I know I got this guy. I Did I get Uncle Charlie? I didn't even remember. I have bought so many things this season while I've been in these stores, and I'm gonna show you guys all the stuff. Oh, look at this. Hello, rat. And hello, cat. And hello, uh, that. Look, guys, it's a big scorpion, but it looks like a face hugger from Aliens. Ah! And look at this. We also have, oh, we have two hugs, but look at this one. It's like he's sad. It's okay, Mr. Hugs. You can go back to murdering soon. We have lots of posable dummy props, and look at this. This one's destroyed. It looks like this guy got hungry and tried to go after the dummy. Oh, we have the super bouncy Sam head. And two side steppers. Sam side steppers. Here we go. It's always best when you get them all going at once. Okay, mister. There you go. We have the Sam inflatable. And oh, somebody sneezed. God bless you. And we, <laughs> we have the flaming pumpkin. Some random guy in spirit saying God bless you to a sneezer. Was that you that sneezed? If so, I think I need the Lysol. I'm glad I'm wearing this mask because that guy definitely has the COVID. Well, look at this. I almost missed this. We got the spinning head Harlequin over here. Ooh, she is super spooky. Let's get her going here. Yes! She is super spooky. We have the Pennywise sidestepper. You crazy laugher, you. Oh, and we almost missed Stay Puffed here. I've seen a couple of these in stores this year, but I have not seen the Slimer. The Slimer with a butt. Okay, here's their section of masks. We'll come back to that, but we're gonna go over here first because I want to see if they have any more animatronics set up anywhere. I, ooh, well, over here. Okay, hold on. It's not an animatronic, but it is a fogging skull pile. All right, let's keep on looking here. I like to look all around the store because you never know, there might be animatronics in some of the cracks and crevices around here. Speaking of cracks and crevices, what in the world? It's a shrunken head. I have never seen the shrunken head in stores before, guys. You, sir, are coming home with me today. That would go so perfectly with a Beetlejuice setup. Okay, let's just come up here and look at this for a minute. You could get the Beetlejuice animatronic right here. You gotta love this guy. And then you could come back here and get one of those dummies we're always looking at. Sorry, sir, you didn't get me. All right, let's go back here a second. Right here, the posable dummy. You could get a posable dummy, rip off his head, and put the shrunken head on his shoulders. <laughs> what in the world? Holy crap, that's the biggest baby head I've ever seen. Look at this thing. It's called a huge heads crying baby mask. What in the world? This guy thinks it's hilarious. Oh my gosh, look guys. The smallest head in spirit next to the biggest head in spirit. <laughs> I don't think I've seen this guy before. He's just called Halloween Clown Mask. Look at that. He's wearing a little top hat. What do you think about it, Mr. Chicken? He actually kind of sounds like Mr. Howl, <laughs> a howling chicken. Oh look, we have the crying baby and then we have the happy baby. What in the world? Here's one I've never seen before, the sloth mugger hugger inflatable. It's a sloth that rides on your back. <laughs> 
I love that, man. I am actually so tempted to get that. Oh, this is a sweet hat right here. The good guy's hat. Oh, look what they have up here too, guys. They have, what is this thing called? I can't even remember. The voodoo knife. I saw this for the first time in a store just a couple days ago. And this one too. This is just, what's this called? Just the Chucky knife. I saw this for the first time in a different store the other day too. Look, we have the slim plaque here too. I love that sound. I wish like his tongue would go. And we also have the spiky side stepper. That is one crazy evil laugh coming from that guy. Oh, this is cool. Look, it's a whole pack of seven scary socks. Oh my gosh, they have the beef squatch costume from Bob's Burgers. Look, this wig is called Mr. Suave. Look at this, it's Chucky's hat from Rugrats. Oh my gosh, that is so cool. Oh man, I would buy this shirt in a split second if it was my size. Krusty Krab Pizza, that's what I'm talking about. This is also one of the coolest costumes in here, guys the South Park Kenny costume. It's inflatable. And look at this one. It's Barney. Back in the day, all the kids watched Barney, but today they watch Nate. Oh, and you could get the purple hairspray if you wanted to dress up like Brick Thunder. Look at this. We got a zero jewelry tray. That is so cool. The only jewelry I have is my wedding ring, and that never comes off, but if it did, it would go in the zero jewelry tray. What in the world is this? It's like an award for being the Sanderson sister. You like me. You really, really like me. I love this sandworm right here, but I especially love the Beetlejuice sign right here. It would go perfectly with the shrunken head. Oh, and here's the Beetlejuice tombstone. This reminds me of Midge Munster. I think she did a whole setup in her yard of Beetlejuice. And speaking of Beetlejuice, look, we have the mask. We have a sandworm cane here. That is totally cool. And look at this. I don't know if I've seen this in other stores. It's a recently deceased handbook crossbody bag. That is pretty cool. And I love how they have the Lydia costume too. That's awesome. Holy crap, they even have Beetlejuice teeth. I wonder if they glow in the dark. All right, we're gonna leave some stickers with this evil plotting guy and a few right here by Sam. And Mr. Buzzsaw has done so well at trying to cut my head off this whole time that we're gonna leave a whole bunch down here. Of course, Mr. Howell deserves some too. Here you go. I know, say thank you. Aw, oh, you're welcome. The real question is, will you still be watching that Nate guy when he looks like this? What in the world? All right, guys, say goodbye to the ghouls and goblins one more time. That's it for Greenwood, South Carolina. Holy crap, it is pouring down rain out here. I told you to stay away. Oh, my God.